This isn't just any drink. This is Biba Extra. Here, try it. <coughs> right. Aren't there supposed to be less boxes in this morning? You know, because you're selling them and everything? Babe, can we just... You're just gonna give up on your house and your wife like that? Thanks so much for tuning in to Woodstock Community Television. I'm Nikki McCallum. We are here on day two of the Vermont Film Festival. So excited. Joining me, we have Stephen Griswold, who is a producer and actor in the film Viva Extra. The world premiere of this yeah. film is happening tomorrow night, Saturday night, at the Pentangle Theater. Stephen would love to hear a little bit about the film. We, I know we had your your colleagues, Kevin and Evan, yep. were here. I would love to hear from your perspective a little bit about the piece. Yeah, so uh, the piece it is a uh, like sort of like a black comedy action, very like in the vein of like Coen Brothers. Um, and it is about an energy drink salesman who is down on his luck, who gets uh, caught up in a sort of get rich scheme that goes wrong. Uh oh. Yeah. How did you come up with the? How did you your team come up with the idea for this film? Are you um, big energy drink heads? Or? No. So uh, there, like back when we all went to college together, and cool. back when we were in college, there was this sort of like multi level marketing scheme um, that was based around an energy drink that was a total pyramid scheme. They'd be like, hey, like I, like you know, you buy cases of energy drinks from me, and then you sell them to other people. And it was just like this complete scheme that like college students were doing and they were like targeting like fraternities and stuff and selling it. And we were like, wow, like what an interesting like idea for someone to get really like caught up in this and, you know, kind of buy into this scheme of, oh, my God, I'll get so rich if I do this and then have it just completely fall apart. Wow. And who do you play in the film? So I play Bill. I play the uh, energy drink salesman. Uh, so I, uh, you know, I'm starting off the film, you know, trying my best, trying to sell this energy drink, and you know, it's not working out. And did, is Bill based off of the the guy who actually sold energy drinks, or is it kind of you invented Bill? Uh, well, Kevin, the writer director, uh, invented the character of Bill. Um, but I had, you know, as an actor, I had to, like, kind of, like, step in and kind of, like, think about who this guy was. And uh, we kind of just settled on, like, this is a guy who kind of, you know, he, he believes. He's a believer. And he, he really believed that, like, okay, this is the thing that I can do to kind of make my life better, to, to put my life in the right direction. And, of course, that doesn't work out. Never does. Got to yeah. watch out for the energy drink sales, folks. Yeah. And so, and you were also a producer on yes. the film. What was that like? Um, so I, I stepped in as a producer very early on. Um, Kevin and I have known each other um, for over a decade. Um, we went to film school together. And uh, during the uh, WGA and uh, SAG strikes, um, he was working on the script of Viva Extra kind of as just like a personal passion project, writing project. He sent it to me, and I gave him some feedback. And, you know, I was just talking to him, and I was like, what do you want to do with this project? And um, I was like, hey, man, like, if we want to, like, you know, go out and make it, like, I, I have experience producing low-budget uh, projects. I was like, let's make this thing. Let's go out and do it. And um, so that was just a really fun process of me and Kevin just looking at a script, figuring out, okay, where are we going to shoot this? Um, you know, what type of equipment are we going to need? How much money do we need? Who can we get to help us out? Uh, and so it's been a, a, a great journey, uh, you know, working with Kevin and helping this go from a script and an idea that he had into uh, a totally finished film. That's so awesome. And I'm so curious, because with indie filmmaking, a lot of times people wear different hats. Mm. What was, was it challenging being pr a producer and an actor? What was that like? Um, so I will say, like, uh, during this project, we did have to put out a lot of fires. Um, but luckily, uh, you know, everyone working on the project were also wearing different hats. And so I think the 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 main thing that I did as a producer um, was just help Kevin uh, get people around him who were knowledgeable, who were talented, who knew what they were doing, and people that we could rely on. And just knowing that, like, when a fire happened, everyone was prepared to, to put it out and move on to the next problem and um, just work together on creative problem solving. That's awesome. That's awesome. Well, Stephen, thank you so much for visiting us today. 
Viva Extra, the world premiere, the Pentangle Theater, Saturday at 6, 6 p.m., right? We're screening yes. at 6 p.m. Yep. I can't wait to see it. Thank and you so much for having me. Yeah, thanks so much for joining. Can't wait to see your film.